Matt Lepke here with your Gamer Goggles, Gamer-Goggles.com. Today we have another box breaking for you. This is on Tomb Trader from level 99. It's a two-player game, I believe? No, three to six players. Oh yeah, this is the game he was telling me about. The more players you have in this game, the more fun it is. It takes roughly 15 minutes to play. Uh, I don't know what the learning curve is because we just talked about it a little bit. Uh, inside you've got the rule book. which is actually a little bit large for them. Um, so it goes over all the components in the game, gives you the overview, the setup obviously, which there's your play area. And, uh, oh, and of course, the red here with the smart code is a tutorial on the game. They, level 99 does that with all their games. Character card, treasure card, round card, uh, gameplay and basically what you are oh there's more on the back ta da uh, you're an archaeologist who's traveling the world right well I don't know if he's traveling the world I'm sure he is traveling the world or well maybe you're not an archaeologist Maybe you're somebody who just snuck into the uh, totally legitimate excavation site and decided to do whatever you're going to do. So inside we have marker chips, um, outside the tomb cards, inside the tomb. And, uh, well, here's a hunter, your character cards, an alchemist, a taxonomist, I don't even know what the heck that is. Maybe that's a taxidermist. Uh, a collector, a gambler, with their different, obviously starting things, a professor, an artist, and then you have some different uh, items, obviously. Adventure hat, snake jar, language stone, tarot deck. Novelty t-shirt, bone dice, hey, <laughs> lucky rock, canop canopic jar, lockbox, ceramic jar, cat statue, alchemy tomes, jewel necklace, cursed jars, ooh, cursed jars are evil, whip, medical kit, snake bites, gotta have snake bites in tombs, right, uh, trinkets, treasure maps, Stone mask, sarcophagus, a crown, that's a crown, that looks more like a helmet, uh, an ancient statue, that's a cool ancient statue, a fortune deck, a gold chalice, preserved jar, revolver, um, so your little outline for five to six players and for three to four players, uh, so inside, well, Inside Tomb Traders, you get the rules, a link to how to play the game, and all the cards you need to play the game along with the uh, little marking chips. Thanks for watching, guys. This has been a box breaking with Matt Lemke from 3 Gamer Goggles, gamer-goggles.com. Uh, check back soon. I hope to have uh, a gameplay demo up uh, in, or maybe an overview. Uh, getting three people to play and on camera um, might be a little bit difficult this time of year. Uh, so maybe it'll just be an overview breakdown for you um, in the next couple weeks. Have a good day.